Yes, it's me, your favorite President Donald Trump, and I'm about to go into that freezing, freezing cold courtroom in Manhattan for this Biden witch hunt trial. Can you believe how cold it is in that courtroom? I asked someone to check for me, and they said, sir, it's 72 degrees. It's so cold. Why is it so cold? That conflicted judge is trying to make it miserable for me. I should be wearing a snow parka. You know that this judge is treating me unfairly. Just look at what he's done with that gag order. He's violating my rights. I've already been found in contempt 10 times. 10 times now, and this conflicted judge hates me so much that he hasn't even thrown me in jail yet like he would have anyone else after their second criminal contempt finding for violating a gag order. America is on the decline, and it was also good to see throughout these trials the support of my family and my wife, Melania, who did so by not being here at all. That's how you present a unified front, by not having one. Melania also wasn't with me at various Mother's Day festivities. I asked her what was wrong, and she said, she said, sir, I have the vapors. There you go. You know who isn't conflicted? Judge Aileen Cannon. What a terrific judge she is, honest and unbiased. She's delayed my classified documents trial indefinitely. She's a true American hero. She might have a supreme reward awaiting her in the future, if you get my meaning, wink, wink. The other day, MAGA Mike Johnson and a bunch of other sycophants whose names I can't be bothered to recall came here, probably on the taxpayer's dime, to symbolically lick my boots and betray their oaths to the Constitution. It was a beautiful thing to see, in case you're wondering, I have dirt on all of these people. That's why they give up their deeply held values so easily. So thank you, MAGA Mike, for helping me out instead of the people in your district or the American people. Maybe Hannibal Lecter will show up to kiss the ring. You never know. It's time to go back to that freezing cold courtroom. I'll be like Jack Torrance, you know, from The Shining. That's how they'll find me at the end of the day. Maybe he can come and protest this injustice. Help me make America great again. Donate money if you can, too. Lots and lots. My God.